What's going on, everybody? Today, we're going to be reacting to the new preview for TFC's High Point. I'm super excited about this because this is a track that all of the, like, the feedback is supposed to be put on. So let's see if there actually is changes to it or if it kind of looks like Hangtown or Paula or even Lakewood. So, so without further ado, let's jump right into the video and see if there's actually those changes that take place. All right, here we go. Videos by Solitude Visuals. We actually just did a reaction video. Um, we actually reacted to one of their videos just couple of days ago already from the footage from the aerial footage it looks like more lines and it looks like the ruts are like really really shown even from that you can kind of see like uh, let me go back i'm already i'm already pausing the video but like look at where my mouse is you can see there's three defined ruts there that's i think that's progress let me move my mouse looks like you can triple up on a 450 maybe okay here we go Let's see what it looks like. First things first, let's put this shit in HD. Okay, it is already. Rip. Um, Stone, turn your bitrate up when you re record, dude. That's that's all I gotta say. Okay, first corner looks good. Doesn't look like too many breaking bumps. Second corner, looks like the breaking bumps are in the very, very inside. It didn't look like too many on the outside. So he doubles. Doubles. So that doesn't look too, too bad. That looks way rougher. But you can kind of see, like, in the video that there's three different lines going back in that corner. And if you look on this one, there's three defined lines on this corner as well. It looks like the ruts actually sweep all the way around the whole S section right there. So that's pretty cool. I can't really tell if those are ruts going up that, but it looked like it. You can see three different ruts on there, too. From... From just watching, it looks like they took the feedback about the ruts being bigger. They're more defined, more... You can see them better as well. It also doesn't look like they, like, cut off at the very end, too. You know how some of those inside ruts that he has usually just, like, die instantly? It doesn't look like that. At least from this POV. It's kind of blurry, but... That wall jump looks way steeper compared to like the the preview, not the preview, but the 2020 version. This is going to be a rough section too. Uh, that, that inside line kind of goes away. I don't know why Stone's taking the inside there. I wish we could see a, a the middle part of the track so you can see like all of like the track, but... Even looks like he has ruts going up that roller, going down the hill. You see how, like, the... Dude, it looks way better. Honestly, the track looks way better than compared to Lakewood. Even this... Like, look at... Okay. That corner right there reminds me of Sim. Of how many ruts there are in that corner. And then if... Yeah, this goes all the way to that wall. Sim has an inside rut there. I don't think bikes would make that work either way. In all honesty, I think the track looks way better. Like, like it literally looks better to me. And let's, you can kind of see, like you, you saw this. Like, let's let's basically break down each section, right? So this breaking bumps right here, I think that's good. I don't think too many people are gonna hit the breaking bumps like Stone did. I think they're gonna cut from left to right here and try to go to that inside line, possibly, or even that middle line. I think that middle line might be a little bit quicker. But then, I don't know. Some people are going to double this. Some people are going to roll that, I think. I think it just really depends on your, like, um, not momentum, but also, like, where your bike is position-wise. I really like... So, I think the roughness is fine here because, like, that section does get rough. But what I think is really good is when the roughness, like, happens, it kind of goes away a little bit so you can get settled into the rut. That's one of the things that we weren't able to do in the last couple tracks of break like the breaking bumps led like right where stone is here you know but now it looks like they end prematurely which is good so like you can kind of see like it ends way before the rut actually occurs i think even like Hangtown, the like the breaking bumps led all the way into the corner you know which i think is way beneficial and like you can see like these ruts wrap all the way around like this whole s section is just one entire rut I think that's pretty good if we like we were complaining about not having like the ruts show up and it's just like out of nowhere like the ruts were there but you can see like the rut all the way around 
I, I think that's going to be pretty good because he gives you the option as like stones rut gives you an option for the guy in the in between like the inside and then one even further inside I like this too. I think that inside probably pretty quick for the 450s. Maybe not 250s, but 450s. I think you can send that. Like you can literally send that probably a little bit further down. This inside line that he takes looks quick. I don't know how this middle line is going to be, but that inside line looks really, really good. Here's another section. I think that I, I think you can possibly double over to that breaking bump. Possibly. Like, if you hit this wall right, and you jump a little bit further, I think you might be able to jump into that rut. I don't think people are going to be doubling this, so that's a plus. That's, like, literally, like, three seconds saved. I like the ruts going into that. Didn't, like... It's hard to tell with the quality, but I don't know if there's too many breaking bumps right here. Like, obviously, there's breaking bumps here, but, like, when you land, there's a few there, right? You can see his bike moving around, but... I don't know how well that's how different that would be for this track compared to like Lakewood. Yeah, I really wish he took that middle line so we can see the ruts on the outside. It looks like I don't know, you see you see this line right here? Whoops. Watch this mouse right here. It looks like this line. I don't like how that rut goes lower right there. You see that right here? I don't I don't like that. It like disappears almost. We'll have to get in game and actually see if that actually happens. But that's one thing I, from the gist of preview, obviously I don't like. I like the I like the lines going on this hill right here. I like that. That adds different like different just a different texture to it. I like how all three of those, all four of those lines, the ruts lead all the way around the corner and not just gives up. I really really do like that. And even this course, you can see that he. He paid attention to the feedback. Not not just my feedback on the video or anything to that nature. A lot of people were saying this. So it's it's really, really awesome to see that the feedback was heard. I want to see now for additional feedback. I wanted to see um, on Friday when the track drops. I want to see are the cuts better on the track. Um, if you make a tiny mistake, I feel like you just get an instant cut. Like just even a tiny mistake go over the like you crash and you go outside of like the markers. You're going to cut. Um, are is there a low quality version is he going to do that um i think that was kind of those are like the two main things that i have because it already looks like the ruts have been fixed the roughness looks better going in and out of corners so that's plus so i'm just excited to see how the track is i want to play it tomorrow obviously or play it today when you guys see this video it drops at 11 west coast time all right maybe i think maybe 11 30 west coast time but i'll put the link and everything in the in the description so you guys can download it but let me know when you guys hop on this track, come back to this video and let me know what you guys think about the track. Does it, is, is it better than Lakewood? Is it better than Hangtown? Or are you guys not like this? Uh, I think this is going to be a game changer. I really do think that this is, this track is going to be a game changer and it's going to be different going forward. And I think it might, might be way better for bikes going forward. So let me know in the comments below what you guys think. Big shout out to my boy 3-2 for the clothing make sure you guys go uh, check out that website i'll put it in the link below but let me know what you guys think about the track in the comments below i hope you guys have a wonderful wonderful day and we'll catch you guys back here in the next video i'm out peace